Annyeong haseyo, and welcome to the Busan Midnight Movie. I'm your host, Donald. Tonight's feature is the political horror comedy, The Werewolf of Washington, which is neither frightening nor funny and has nothing to say about politics. It is trash, though. Before we get to that, we have the next episode of The Great Alaskan Mystery. Last time, Grit joined Jim, Ruth, and the bosun's polycule, and the four went to vacation in the country. On their way home, Brandon, jealous of their romantic success, drives them off the road. And now, episode 8 of The Great Alaskan Mystery, In a Flaming Plane. Welcome back. Because this is the weekend of the presidential inauguration in Washington, D.C., I chose a movie set in Washington for tonight's feature, The Werewolf of Washington. Reporter Jack Whittier is bitten by a werewolf before flying to the States to assume his role as press secretary. Falling victim to the curse, Jack starts killing people who stand in the way of the president's goals. The movie features a few one-off gags that suggest the makers weren't sure whether they wanted to make a political satire or a horror spoof, and so settled on something disappointing. However, it does have Dean Stockwell of Quantum Leap in Paris, Texas as the titular werewolf, which is a definite plus. Now sit, stay, and laugh at the werewolf of Washington. And now a word from our sponsor. That it could happen in America. That it could happen now. In an age of unrest, when our nation faces imagined threats. The Panthers! How do you know it's the Panthers? I know it! We need a president who inspires, who knows how to speak to the press. Uh, today, I'm pleased to announce the indictment of... Uh, <clears throat> Secondly, the anarchist must be punished. And who can get the work done. It's time that we as a nation stand behind the man with the plan. That guy. Paid for by Republicans who want you to forget that their party launched a failed coup against their own nation. Oopsie, sorry. Oh, that, that's great. We'll use it. And now, back to tonight's feature, The Werewolf of Washington. That was tonight's movie, The Werewolf of Washington. And wow! If you ever have doubts about the thing you want to make, remember that this exists. Here's a preview of what we'll be watching next time. The quarantine is weighing heavily upon Vincent Price. There was a time when eating was pleasurable. Now it bores me. Exhausted, he does what everyone has done. Creates a podcast. Takes up crafting. Hunts down and kills everyone who gathers without a mask. Will he last until a vaccine arrives, or will Republican insurrectionists force him to reopen before it's safe? Find out in The Last Man on Earth on the Busan Midnight Movie. Under no circumstances should you gather the public. If you're the dire emergency that exists, I intend to. Doesn't that look grim? As always, Kamsamnida, and thank you for watching. If you enjoyed yourself, please like, share, and subscribe. And until next time, stay safe, stay inside, and stay spooky.